Residents on Friday assessed the damage caused to their town after flooding devastated Spain's Valencia region. Two days after the deluge started on Tuesday, authorities say they have recovered 158 bodies and continue to search for an unknown number of missing people. The damage recalled the aftermath of a tsunami, with survivors left to pick up the pieces as they mourn their loved ones. In the badly hit town of Chiva, where it rained more in eight hours than it had in the preceding 20 months, local resident, Juan Vicente Perez, wept as he pointed out the remains of his partially collapsed house. I have been there all my life, all my memories are there, my parents live there, they all live there, and now in one night it is all gone, he said. He said he and his wife fled to a neighbor's house just minutes before his own home was hit by the floods. He said there was no warning from the authorities but believed that everyone was taken by surprise by the ferocity of the flash floods that swept away everything in their path. Another local resident said people were starting to do what they could to clean up the town. While authorities were giving out food, water and clothes, there was still no water, gas or electricity, the local said. This week's flash floods are also Spain's deadliest natural tragedy in living memory, surpassing the flood that swept away a campsite along the Gallego River in Baescas, in the northwest, killing 87 people in August 1996. La que se acaba de destruir o la del lado? Esa, la, la, la que tiene el agujero. La sí. otra. ¿Cuál ha caído? Pues toda la vida, tengo 62 años. Toda la vida ahí. Todo, todos mis recuerdos, mis padres me dieron, me dieron la casa, me dieron todo. Y, y ahora de la noche a la mañana esto digo. Y, y por cinco minutos más no, no estamos vivos porque no fuimos a casa de los vecinos a los que tengo que estar agradecidos Santo, Amparo, Iker y Evan ahí en los pisos de frente si no, si tardamos cinco minutos más ya no, ya no estaríamos en el mundo ¿Cuánto es eso? Esto es lo que nos ha caído ¿Tú ves la casa blanca? ¿Esta? ¿Esta? Pero la... Los avisos no hubo ninguno, o sea, nosotros también creo que al final se lo sobrepasó a todo, porque esto, esto, es verdad que se debería de avisar, pero en, en esas circunstancias no, no, no creo que nadie pudiera hacer nada tampoco, era una cosa fuera de lo normal, jamás vista en la edad que tengo yo y en la edad de mis padres, nada, en la riada famosa del 57 que yo no había nacido, mis padres... No, dijeron que aquí no pasó nada en esta calle, y, pero bueno, es, es, ha sido una hecatombe, una hecatombe, hija mía. ayudando pues en todo lo que se pueda para limpiar el pueblo porque hay mucho hay excavadoras hay tractores por todo voluntarios el ayuntamiento está repartiendo agua en la otra punta del pueblo también han dado comida y ropa todo lo necesario claro o sea que estamos dentro de lo malo no nos falta de nada de momento No tenemos ni agua, ni luz, ni gas, y eso va a tardar. Sí. Es que hay mucho mal, hay mucho mal, hay mucho mal. Por arriba está todo arrancado, 
un desastre, esto es un desastre. ¿Qué, es, qué se siente al ver tu pueblo así? Es tu pueblo, ¿no? Es mi pueblo, impotencia, total. Impotencia y eso. ¿Qué, te quiere? ¿Qué quieres que te diga? Muy mal todo, muy mal. Monstrous flash floods that claimed at least 95 lives in Spain left scenes of devastation in Valencia on Thursday, with wrecked cars and trucks piled up along the highways of the Mediterranean city. The death toll could rise as search efforts continue with an unknown number of people still missing. Walls of rushing water turned narrow streets into death traps and spawned rivers that ripped into the ground floors of homes and swept away cars, people and anything else in its path. Thousands of people were left without water and electricity and hundreds were stranded after their cars were wrecked or roads were blocked. The region remained partly isolated with several roads cut off and train lines interrupted, including the high-speed service to Madrid, which officials say won't be repaired for several days. While Valencia took the brunt of the storm, another two casualties were reported in the neighboring Castilla-La Mancha region. Southern Andalusia reported one death. Valencia's regional government is being criticized for not sending out flood warnings to people's mobile phones until 8 p.m. on Tuesday, when the flooding had already started in some parts. Spain's Mediterranean coast is used to autumn storms that can cause flooding. But this was the most powerful flash flood event in recent memory. Scientists link it to climate change, which is also behind increasingly high temperatures and droughts in Spain and the heating up of the Mediterranean Sea.